Hey guys, it's Zemfy here, and welcome to another part in my Crunker map making tutorial series. Today, we are going to be looking at saving your progress and posting your maps. This process can be a little confusing, but it's really not that hard once you understand it. So let's get into it. So you have a map in the editor, or at least part of one, and now you need to save it. Just go to File, then Save As, and it should save a text file to your computer. You might be wondering what the difference between saving and exporting is. But exporting just exports the map data. It stores everything that is actually in the map. But saving your maps saves the groups, the object names, the camera position, and the selection, and other stuff like that. Pretty much when you import a save, it will look exactly as it did when you saved it. Anyways, I recommend saving a lot. It really sucks when you lose progress, especially when you've done a lot of work. So just save more often than you might think. Anyways, now you've come back to the editor and you want to import your save. Just go to File and then click Import. Now open your map file. This could be an export or a save. And copy all of the text. Then go back to the editor and paste it in the box and then click OK. Now you should have your map just as you left it. There is one even easier little trick for importing maps. If you shift click on the import button, it will bring up the file browser. Then if you open a map file, it automatically imports the text into the editor. That's just a useful trick to keep in mind when importing maps. Okay, that about sums up saving your maps. Now let's move on to publishing them. Okay, so the first thing you're gonna wanna do is export your map. You can find the export button right here at the top of your screen. And once you click that, it will give you a text file with all of your map data. You will need this later when we actually post the map. Okay, the next step is to make a thumbnail. This step isn't required, but I guarantee you people are much more likely to play a map that has a thumbnail than one that doesn't. If we head to the map page, you can see almost all of the popular maps have thumbnails. But if you head to the new maps page, almost all of them don't. The ones that do really stick out and people are much more likely to click on them. Anyways, how do you actually make a thumbnail? Well, you can use any photo editing software you like whether that be Photoshop or Pixlr or something else, it's up to you. You can use PNG images or GIF images as your thumbnail. The maximum size for your file is 80 KB for normal players or 150 KB for premium. So it might take some trial and error to get your thumbnail to be that size or under. If it's too big, then just reduce the resolution until it works. Now that you have an export file and a thumbnail, you are ready to upload your map. Head over to the Crunker social page, either through the menu or go to crunker.io slash social.html. Next, go to the games tab right here. Now click on the publish button and choose game. Okay, now you wanna open up that text file you exported and copy all of the text. Next, go back to the publish page and paste it in the paste data. Now click on the select button and choose your thumbnail. Next, you can put in a YouTube link to a video, and this is completely optional as it says. Um, the only time you'll be able to see the YouTube link is in this social page, so it's definitely not necessary. Now you can write a description of your map for other players to see. Once again, the only place you can see this is on the social page, so it doesn't really matter that much. And then you can just press publish map. It should say uploading, then success. All right, everything should have gone smoothly, but there are a few common errors that I would like to address. The first one is illegal characters in map name. There are a few allowed characters like underscore, but most of them are quote unquote illegal. And if you get this error, try removing them. The next common error is just illegal characters. This probably occurred because you used the save version instead of exporting. Make sure you exported your map instead of saving it. And finally, failed dot 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 try again. This error is quite annoying as it's very unclear what causes it, but try reloading and that should fix it. Finally, there are a few things to keep in mind. You need to be level five to publish maps and 10 to use thumbnails in them. I would also like to mention how to update your map. It's extremely simple. You just follow the exact same steps as publishing. Basically, when you publish the map again, with the exact same name, it will update it. If you change the name at all, it will just publish it as a new map. 
So that just about does it for this tutorial on posting your map. If this helped, leave a like and be sure to subscribe to see more content like this. Don't forget to join the MMOK Discord if you have any questions. But now let's move on to the next part of the series. Bye!